Hey guys, I uh, have Fedora 31 here and I'm manual capturing it on my MacBook Pro over there. And um, yeah, let's let's get into it, shall we? Start Fedora Workstation Live 31. So the reason why I'm trying Fedora 31 is that I wanted to see what Wayland was like natively. And the TLDW version is that you can't really tell that because it's running X Wayland. So basically, as I understand it, Wayland has uh, X org compatibility. So in my opinion, I want to know what it's like not running Xorg. I want to know what what you know what Wayland is like, and I don't really know by running Firefox or or GNOME Terminal if I'm getting the real Wayland benefits. Oh, it's asking me. Oh, you can't see that it's asking me to try that I'm trying. Hold on, let me change the display settings. Anyway, I thought it would, since I have this rig set up, I can. So this, I'm just mirroring my display because displays are treated differently to my laptop and the HDMI, I guess. So this is what it looks like. And uh, yeah, is this easy to use? You have to like put your mouse in the top left and you get this thing and then your terminal's hidden down here somewhere. Um, I don't know, copy and pasting, all that stuff works, but yeah, it runs, oh no, that's not maximize. What is maximize? PS aux grep minus I Wayland. It runs X Wayland. And if I kill that, it all goes to hell. Oh yeah, I did try and install Sway, but it doesn't give you an option to choose Sway as your window manager when logging out and things like that. So is, does anyone know how to try Sway uh, as a live ISO? That would be also interesting. Yeah, killing x Wayland, everything is gone. Anyway, please like the video. Please subscribe for more. I'm always sort of just evaluating the whole desktop experience. I think I, I, think I need to try OpenBSD next, don't I? Um, thanks for watching guys. Bye now. Happy 2020.